So tonight for dinner, we are having this honey grilled shrimp with roasted corn relish, cilantro rice, and spicy creme fraiche. Now I couldn't find creme fraiche at the store, so we're gonna have to improvise with something else. But here is the recipe. Now our shrimp are finishing defrosting, so we're gonna go ahead and make our marinade. Um, so let's get to that. Okay, it says we're gonna need one to two, tubal, <laughs> one to two tablespoons of honey. My hand strength isn't as good as it used to be. That's one. All right, let's do another. Come on. Good Lord. Okay, so that's two tablespoons of honey. Okay. All right, and then we're gonna add, I've got some chipotles and adobo. So we're gonna add two chipotle peppers. You know, I've never actually had these before, so I want to give it a little taste. Ooh, it's spicy, but it's good. Okay, so we're going to get our little cutting board out. Okay, so we need two of these. No wonder Bobby Flay always uses these. They're delicious. Okay, and then we need two tablespoons of this adobo sauce. One. Two. Okay, and then we're gonna do let me rinse off my cutting board. We need three minced cloves of garlic. That's one. Okay, and when you open it back up, remember take that skin out. Let me see if I can put these in together. No. Take I'm gonna do one more big one. I'm gonna find a big one. Oh, look at this one. Look how big that is. Then we're going to need a tablespoon of water. One tablespoon of water, one tablespoon of olive oil. Oops. 
and then some lime juice. Okay, there we go. Just go ahead and use a whole lime because it's not very, I mean, it's juicy, but it's kind of hard. Okay, I'm gonna take this and mix this up. All right, let's go ahead and mix this up. You wanna get that honey moving around. Mm, that's good. Like it's not your normal boring. Ooh, let's get that garlic in there too. All right, now we're gonna get our shrimp in. All right, now we're gonna get our shrimp into that marinade. We're gonna let this sit for a little bit before we grill. I'm gonna make sure all of them have some of that marinade on them. All right, now while this is marinating, we're gonna get started on our corn salsa. All right. All right. We're gonna make our corn relish. I'm gonna preheat my oven to 450. And then I am going to take my corn and spread it out here on the sheet. This is frozen corn that I just defrosted. This is two 12 ounce bags. I wasn't sure if 12 would be enough, but I'm sure it's going to be plenty enough leftovers. Okay, now we are going to toss with olive oil. this mixed all around and then it needs to be in a single layer so we're going to try to get this all just flattened out and then we're going to put it in the oven for 20 minutes let me get my cilantro lime rice started Let's get this corn salad made while the um, corn is finishing roasting. I'm gonna get all the other stuff ready. We are going to need a tablespoon of jalapeno. touch this because that's the hot part but should have worn gloves well it's done it's done just don't touch my face okay. so finally dice this you can't even see what I'm doing. It's gonna go in our little bowl right here. And then we are going to add a quarter cup of diced cherry tomatoes. 
Whoa. Come on. That was hard to get off. We're just gonna have these. I'm gonna do about a half a cup instead of just a quarter because these are so yummy. <sighs> Let's see. Oops, I put that in there. That should be plenty. Now it says scallions, cilantro, Here. Let me check out my corn in the oven. So I checked the corn, it's not quite done yet, so we're gonna make the dressing for this. Now it says lime zest. All right, we're gonna add half a teaspoon of lime zest. And I'm using a microplane for this. of sugar, quarter teaspoon chili powder, quarter teaspoon cumin. quarter teaspoon of cumin. And then, oops, a quarter teaspoon of chili powder. And then we will add our corn as soon as it's done.
ratio to be right, so I'm not going to add all the corn that I did. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to see what it is once I put this in here and get everything mixed up. Alright, that looks good. Now the last ingredient in this corn salad is to add some cilantro. There's not really that much corn left, so I just have to I don't want to waste it. cilantro in which I have right here. I'm going to chop this whole bunch of cilantro um, because I'm going to need some for my cilantro lime rice. Let me give this a rinse. because you don't want greedy cilantro. All right. give a little taste. Mm, that's good. Okay, so this is going to be for the cilantro lime rice. I don't want to chop it too much because I don't want to bruise it. It's done. Go ahead and get our shrimp grilled. I think it's ready now. Let's try it. We're gonna have to do this in a couple of batches. Because you don't want to crowd because of the steam. Let's give our shrimp flip. Look at these beautiful shrimp. The second batch is in. This is the first batch. I'm going to clean off my table so I can get ready. So for dinner tonight, we are having the um, honey chipotle shrimp over cilantro lime rice with a corn salad. So we are going to head and get that plated. We're gonna go ahead and get that plated now. I did do the recipe for it. It's gonna be on YouTube because it is a little long. So we're just gonna make a bed here. All right, now we're gonna plate our corn salad. Which is surprisingly good. I've tried it already. And as you can tell, this is a recipe full of cilantro. So if you don't like cilantro, you're not gonna like this recipe. Then we're going to put the shrimp on top. And that is dinner. All right, here is a final look at it before we eat it.